Hey everyone and welcome to, to Boss Advisory. Today we're going to talk about 6 businesses that will never go out of market. You're in the right place if you want successful, reliable companies. No business will never fail. Any business with profit potential is risky. The risk return trade off suggests that potential reward rises with proportional risk. Equities have a superior long term yield than savings accounts. High yield investments like enterprises can yield returns over 30%. This is risky. 20% of new businesses fail during the first two years, 45% within the first five years, and 65% within the first 10 years. This shouldn't stop you from starting a business. Some firms are more successful. Today's video is about low failure enterprises. Let's begin. In this video, I'll discuss six low failure enterprises. I'll also offer statistics showing these low failure rates and some useful tools. Why know these failure rates? Most new business owners and entrepreneurs commit time, energy, and money in launching their businesses. If you're establishing a business, you should choose one with a good possibility of success, right? Having the odds in your advantage is always a good thing, even if you have a smart business mind. Number 1. Vending Machine Success is connected to vending machine business. 90% of vending machines sell. 85% of enterprises fail. Compare a vending machine company to a small business. Many businesses fail because of advertising, rent, and other costs. Finding and retaining competent employees can be difficult. Your vending machines work 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, allowing you to generate money even while you sleep. That's a great way to make money. Years have brought transformation. Jobs are no longer safe. If you still read newspapers, you'll discover that corporate downsizing affects many people. When 90% of us work for others, job security is non-existent. The vending machine industry is unlike any other. It allows the owner to start a vending machine route with little or no knowledge and work from home in an all-cash business. Is that right? Cash-only vending machines. A vending machine business has unique advantages. Immediate financial flow. You'll start making money immediately. No bad checks, credit risks, or accounts receivable. Year-round business. No seasonal income variations. Varied hours with lots of time off. Little overhead. No rent, utilities, etc. No workers to pay when you work from home. You can start this business part-time while still working full-time. Laundromats are another low-failure company. According to LA Lux, 66% of potential entrepreneurs are afraid of company failure. One study found that 95% of laundromats survive 5 years. Nothing in the business is guaranteed, but that's close. This business can make money in any economy. Garments must be cleaned and dried constantly. Laundromats can be run quietly. Machines wash and dry clothes, and clients load and unload them. The fun part is cleaning, repairing, and collecting money from the devices. But you can hire others to help. Number 2. Real Estate Andrew Carnegie said 90% of the wealthy are property owners. Real estate has made more money than industrial investments combined. Real estate investing has an inviolable 85.3% success rate. Why is property so profitable? Money cash flow? Renters will pay down your mortgage, and your properties will appreciate. When you combine these benefits with the ability to borrow to buy rental homes, you have a powerful wealth generator. Your rental property business can earn passive revenue if you hire a property manager, but you don't need to. Your properties are still manageable. Each takes 5 to 10 hours per month, passive in my opinion. Number 3. Healthcare Healthcare is fast-paced business with many future opportunities from pharmacies to dentistry. Cost, complexity, and uncertainty may make this sector unpleasant. But with the correct approach, it won't fail. Investors, businessmen, entrepreneurs, and inventors should attempt this year. 
future healthcare opportunities are huge. In most developed nations, healthcare consumes over 10% of GDP, according to policy advice. By 2019, this number will be close to 18% in the U.S. Imagine how high it is. This is not surprising, given that healthcare is the largest U.S. employer. The U.S. spends more than everyone else on healthcare. The $8.45 trillion global health business 2022 global healthcare spending could top $10 trillion. Healthcare is one of the world's largest and fast-growing industries, according to data. As doctors and nurses are overwhelmed by the quantity of patients during the COVID-19 epidemic, individuals are turning to small medical centers or clinics instead of general hospitals for fear of contracting the virus. Number 4. The Transportation Business If you have a smart business approach, you can make money in transportation. There are various chances in this field, but you must first study regional demand. Ambulances, medical emergencies, outstation shifting, etc. are also important transportation characteristics. Congestion in many large cities has allowed public and private transit to coexist. Many people rely heavily on transportation. Due to the above, demand in transportation industry has skyrocketed. Taxis, Ubers, and Lyfts are rising. It's a profitable business and a popular startup idea. E-commerce, the gig economy, and online platforms have made starting a transportation business easier. What's a transport company? A transportation business transports goods or people for a fee. A transportation business can range from long haul to driving for Uber on the weekends. 76.4% of these businesses succeed. Some transportation companies may be riskier than others. On average, success is high. Number 5. Farming Agriculture is fifth on our list since it feeds billions of people every day. World Bank data shows agriculture contributed 4% of the global GDP in 2018. Agribusiness is the manufacture and marketing of agricultural products. In certain developing countries, it accounts for more than 25% of GDP. Like agricultural equipment, supplies, and services, agricultural enterprises are resilient and have a low failure rates. These enterprises include farms, associated companies, 88% of agriculture enterprises succeed. If you're interested in farming or agriculture, this could be the appropriate chance for you. Number 6. The Dump Truck Business We know you're surprised, but here is out. According to small BI trends, the mining industry has the highest survival rate of 51.3%. Mining business startups are challenging and expensive. There's a backdoor way to profit from mining stability. If you reside near a mine, you'll need dump trucks to move coal and other goods. Starting a mining firm doesn't require millions. An old dump truck costs $15,000 or less. Growing demand for dump trucks means additional driving jobs. The U.S. dump truck service sector is expected to reach $20.64 billion by 2025. And that's just for mining and construction. Now is the time to establish a dump truck company. Dump truck operation is different. Corporate or private delivery companies who offer their own dump truck services or outsource fleet labor create a need for newcomers. Even if you don't live near a mine, you can use a dump truck in other sectors. Construction companies, land scrapers, real estate flippers, and even homeowners may need your services. And I'll close it with problem-solving businesses never fail. If you're an entrepreneur or planning to start a business, solve a problem. Transparently run your business and hire ethical employees. If you do that, you'll succeed. Thank you guys so much for watching Boss Advisory. If you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, and hit the bell so you get notified on every new incredible content we make for you. Have a wonderful day and see you on the next one.